smell as bad as you look. What have you got me into, Rock? And muscle bow. Ah, you must be Dylan. And you are? Uh, Dr. James Cyrus. Uh, my humblest apologies for dragging you into this, but I think for the sake of human civilization, it was a fortunate accident. Dr. Cyrus? Dr. James Cyrus? That's impossible. Uh, come with me, we have much to discuss.
This island is covered in iridium powder. Anywhere the time vortex touches, it leaves this material behind. I believe it was just such a vortex, triggered by a magnetic reversal of the Earth's poles, that caused the greatest extinction the Earth has ever known. And if my calculations are correct, another event of even greater magnitude is almost upon us. And the Mayans knew it, the Sumerians knew it, and so did these men. The German submarine U-1226, missing since October 1944, and it was carrying an experimental device. It is called the Zeitlich Turbulen Machine, or Temporal Vortex Engine. As you can probably guess, the experiment was a great success. Here, the wreckage of the U-1226 is in a cave five kilometers east of here. If the device can be repaired... Then we can go home. Yes, and the world can be warned of the coming cataclysm and possibly find a way to stop it. Then what are we doing just sitting here looking at old pictures? Why not just have me and Rock go get the damn thing and... Mr. Dillon, Rock is in no condition to endanger himself. What are you talking about? Rock's six foot three of pure Navy SEAL. Not anymore, he's not. Who? It's me, Dylan. It's Rock. It's been a long time. <sighs> Such is the nature of the Temple of Vortex. It it's like falling into a raging river. Even if you fall in at the same place, there's no telling how far the current will take you or where you'll come out. Rock found me and the last of my crew 30 years ago. Don't worry, man. I'm gonna get us out of here. Okay, Doc. Tell me more about this German sub. 